the Unclean Expert Series episode entitled, Why Are Surveyors Focusing on Point-of-Use Instrument Care? was written by enzymatic expert Peggy Spitzer, Clinical Education Manager at Sertal International. Contaminated instruments frequently take a one- or two-hour trip from the end of treatment to the start of soak time in central processing. Meanwhile, blood and other soils are drying to create biofilm and corrosion. The challenge for the healthcare facility is creating a team process to prevent formation of dried soils and biofilm on reusable medical devices and instruments. This problem affects many departments, including surgical, cardiac catheterization, endoscopy, dental, and ophthalmic care. Time becomes the enemy, along with blood, fats, and cements. Salts and blood soil can start corrosion on some types of metals within 10 minutes. Dried orthopedic cement becomes impossible to remove from reamers after 1 to 2 hours. The healthcare facility needs special tactics to improve patient safety through point-of-use care. 1. Compliance with point-of-use care will affect scheduling and productivity, so management support is essential. 2. Deliver training and supplies to all point-of-use departments coordinated by nurse educators, infection preventionists, and sterile processing managers. 3. It is critical to routinely wipe off or flush soils during surgical and clinical procedures with sterile water and sponges. 4. If transport delay is frequently over one hour, coverage with wet towels may not prevent corrosion. Select a point-of-use treatment spray tested and validated to provide anti-corrosives and effective enzyme action. 5. Use OSHA biohazard-compliant transport containers with solid sides, bottom, and lids. Thanks for listening to this episode of the Beyond Clean Expert Series. For more chemical questions and answers, you can contact Peggy at pspitzer at sertal.com.